Hello, I'm Livy Morgan, and welcome to a special senior-only episode of Hornet Nation. This week, we listened to some advice from senior athletes. Cole Pelton goes in their shoes for the last time, and we take a look at some of the bloopers from this season. Signing off for the last time, I'm Livy Morgan. Enjoy the show. For underclassmen athletes, we've put together an inside look at some advice from our fellow seniors. Your host for this special is already committed to Central Michigan University and is looking to study broadcasting as well as expand his horizons as a vocalist. Get out a pencil and paper as we send it to Thomas Payer. Well seniors, we only have two days left until we are gone for good. That being said, I'm going to walk around the school and see what kind of tips you guys want to leave for the underclassmen. Let's go. So, what tips do you have for your underclassmen athletes? For underclassmen athletes, I would just say to do goodly. And Shay? Uh, don't go in the woods and dink around like I did sophomore year. Very interesting tips. Uh, I would say to underclassmen to stay focused because, uh, you know, the bond with your team is uh, special and uh, you're never going to get that back, so enjoy it while it lasts. So, Eric. What tips do you have for the underclassmen athletes of Saline High School? Well, basically, find a sport that you enjoy more than one that you're good at, because if you enjoy something, you're going to work harder towards that goal, and drink lots of water, eat lots of spinach. Um, enjoy every moment, and don't take anything for granted. Nice. Woo! Those were some amazing tips from our senior athletes. Underclassmen, I hope you were taking notes. Well. So for now, signing off for Hornet Nation, I'm Thomas Pear. Back to you in the studio. Some of those tips were oddly specific, but hopefully you find some of our seniors' advice useful. Thanks, Hornets, for making this last season memorable for me. Thomas, the spotlight is once again yours. Hello, Celine. I'm Thomas Pear. Cole Pelton has made quite a career out of trying and failing at many of the sports that take place here at SHS. Now let's take a look at some of his best well, I guess we should say his worst moments of In Their Shoes. Finally, Cole Belton has come back to In Their Shoes. I'm here with Fogan Evans, the Celine dance team. What does it take to be a diver? I'm Cole Pelton. And I'm Mallory Bone. This has been In Their Shoes. In Your Shoes. And this has been In Their Shoes. Well, it's a good thing that Cole doesn't play a lot of sports. And now he can say, finally, I don't have to fail on camera anymore. It's been an honor for me to provide coverage to you all for the past two years. Make sure to catch me on Central Michigan Television in the near future. Signing off for the last time, I'm Thomas Pear. Go Hornets and fire up chips. Hi, I'm Daniel Emerson, and it is sad to say I will be signing off for the last time. But first, Hornet Nation is known to be quite polished with everyone working to make sure the show runs smoothly. But with every good, there is some bad to go with it. Let's take a look through all the bloopers, slip-ups, and embarrassing moments that took place while working on the show this season. We want to welcome you to the first episode of Hornet Nation. <laughs> In 2019, can we do that? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Hornet Nation. 
<laughs> Sorry. The Celine swim team recently had their senior night. Cole, can you tell us about your high school swimming career? Wait, that's not Cole. To introduce us to yet another coach starting out here at Celine. <laughs> we want to welcome you to the first episode of Hornet Nation in 2019. I'm Colin Wagner. And I'm Olivia Morgan. <laughs> ah, we're so ready. It's like unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Oh. <laughs> Megan, Megan, I refute Megan. This is. Good question. It's had a knockout, knockout season, season this, this year. year. Thanks, Thanks to Paul. Some of the team members to hear their take. Crowned a prom queen in the middle school. Ah, oh, sounds wonderful. Absolutely splendid. Follow us on Twitter at Hornet Nation, and no. for the latest show updates. Peace out. Hornets. <laughs> Man, we have lots of fun moments here on Hornet Nation. That's all for this show. Tune in next time for live interviews with the winners of the Play of the Year, as well as a season wrap-up. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, at Nation Hornet, for the latest show updates, and check out our YouTube channel, Salim Video. This was the final episode of Hornet Nation for the seniors on the show. So I would like to say that these past couple of years being on Hornet Nation have been some of the great times that I will always remember. When I first came to Hornet Nation, I just wanted to be an anchor for the show, but then I did a segment of In Their Shoes and I just fell in love with that segment. I've embarrassed myself doing In Their Shoes with lots of sports. My only regret is that I couldn't do all sports. I want to thank all my fans out there that like my skills as an anchor and as a guy who can't play sports. So signing off for the last time on Hornet Nation, I'm Cole Pelton. Check you later, Hornets. Action.